welcome to white chocolate source this is harry in this short video i am going to show you how to reset or unlock your windows account password in your desktop or laptop in case you need to and this is by using daysop recovery tool so let's start first let's head on to our browser and search for daysop and open their website then go to download here we can see the different download options. There is a recovery suite which contains all the components but there are also downloads for individual components such as data recovery, disk image and clone, windows recovery and password recovery. But here we will download the Laysop recovery suite 4.5 home edition. After download, let's install it to our PC. So this is how the software interface looks like. Now let's create an ISO file using the Laysop Media Builder. So go to the Laysop folder and look for LS Media Builder file. For the version, we will just keep it as default. Click Next. Now browse for the target location, then click Start. This will take some time, but I will forward the video. Okay, let's copy it to the desktop. Our ISO file is now created. Let's now create a bootable USB with this ISO. Okay, plug in the USB, then open Rufus. Select the lace of ISO, which is the LS boot. For the partition scheme, this will depend on your device if it supports GPT or MBR. Here I will just select GPT, so click start. This will also take some time but I will forward the video. Now plug in the USB to your PC or laptop that needs password resetting. On our example here, we have a Windows account called WCS and it's asking to input password. Now let's restart our PC so we can boot to our lace of ISO. Here I am pressing F12 because that is the key to select the boot option for Gigabyte motherboard. Other laptop brands will be a different key, so here are some of them. Okay, here we will select our USB and click Days of Live CD. Okay, so now it booted to Laysop software. Let's go to password recovery. Click next. Then click yes. Then click next again. Here we will see all the accounts available on our system. As you can see on the WCS user account, the blank password is set to no. So that's the one that we will remove. Click next. So our sample account here is also locked out. We will select the button reset or unlock. And that's it. 
uh, click finish and reboot and you can now remove your USB Okay, now as you can see, the WCS user account is not anymore requiring for password. And now we can set a new password for our account. And that's it. Hope this video will help. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.